Uh, you you <laughs> changed your career, your life, essentially, didn't you? Yeah, that's right. After um, six fantastic years traveling all over the world, making social media for a company, um, the pandemic halted any travel or live events and the chances of meeting new people. So as, as the months moved on, I saw that there was a gap in the market to help businesses realize um, the potential of genuine social media presence. And um, I saw so many bricks and mortar shops having to pivot to moving on to using their social media more effectively. So I I decided to hand my notice in and set up Middle Horse Media. So it was a calculated risk, but one that I haven't regretted since. What's the best part of the change for you? Is it, is it being your own boss? Yeah, I love it. I just yeah. love um, the buzz that I get whenever I'm... Um, explaining things for um, business owners that have come so naturally to me because I've practiced them for years and just the buzz they get when they press post. Um, like I love being like the, their biggest cheerleader and um, giving them the confidence to show up on camera because so many people are so self-critical, especially female business owners. They can be very self-critical <laughs> of how they look or how they sound on camera. And I just love giving them the confidence boost to get out there and just try and put themselves out there and, and showcase what their business is about. You, and this is true of Lindsay as well, but Lynn, you, you're, you're obviously not frightened of risks because, you know, it's one thing to move from one job to another job where you're employed by somebody else. But, you know, in a pandemic during pandemic just coming out of it to start up your own company is a big thing to do absolutely and I, I put a couple of um steps in place so i i knew that because mine was a service based i didn't have any um overheads i didn't have to buy anything i had a phone and that was enough to get me through and as the months have gone on i'm in month um eight now i um you know, I can start to like look at maybe getting different equipment, things mm -hmm. like that. And secondly, I also made sure to surround myself with the right people. And um, I joined um, um, an accelerator, a, a cohort called She Generate, who are a group of all Ireland female founders who really helped me with the nitty gritty of starting a business. You know, your finance sides, um, how to establish who your customer profiles are, <laughs> all the things that I would have been floundering about, I think, for months more had I not had these uh, women just talking so openly and giving their time that we're already years down the line on setting up businesses. So that was excellent. Lynn, thank you very much. Lynn Much there uh, from Noodle Horse Media. I didn't even have to open the screen again to remember that. <laughs>